Good morning, everyone. My name is Pastor Eketu Pichinidum, and I'm your host at Everyday Prayer Guide Television. Today, we shall be looking at powerful, a blessed morning prayer to start your day. A blessed morning prayer to start your day. And our focus is this. You shall see the hand of God today. You shall see the hand of God today. That's our focus of today's morning prayer. It's important for us to know that we serve a God who is an ever-present help in time of, of need. He's our ever-present helper in times of our need. He's a God that will never fail his children. Now, he may not come when you expect him to come, but he always comes on time. Now, I don't know what you are going through this morning. I don't know what you are passing through as a child of God this morning, but I want you to know that God is your helper. And he said in his word, I will never leave you nor forsake you. He's, you are going to see his hand in your life today in the mighty name of Jesus. Now, one of the challenges with a lot of believers is that we are we easily uh, our challenges easily get our attention than God you know we are always overwhelmed with the things we don't have that that we that that we forget the things that we have and listen to me in the midst of that storm God is with you if you focus on God and not on the storm the storm cannot sink you you know when Peter was walking on water towards Jesus at his command now he he, he was as as far as his eyes was fixed on Jesus he was walking above the waters but the more moment he moved his focus from Jesus to the storms, he began to sink. Now that's the challenge of our lives. The reason why many of us are sinking is because our eyes is in the storm. We put fix our eyes in the problems of our lives. Oh, we don't have money. Oh, we don't have a job. Oh, we don't have marriage. We don't have a husband or wife. Oh, our marriage is in turbulence. Oh, our children are not doing well. Oh, there are debt. We have a lot of debt in our heads. Oh, this and that. Oh, that and that. You know, you, we are worried so much about the storms of our life. Our eyes is fixed on the storms instead of on Jesus. Now, when you fix your eyes on Jesus, when you see him as your hope, when you see him and you, when you look at your life and say, well, there are lots of problems in my life, but I keep my eyes on Jesus because I know that I'm going to come out of this situation. I know I'm going to come out triumphant. I know, I may not know how, but I know that God is going to make a way for me wherein there is no way. I am helped. I can never be disadvantaged because Jesus is with me. I can never be lonely because he said he will never leave me nor forsake me. Though I don't know how to come out of these challenges, but I know I'm going to come out of it because my helper is at work behind the scenes. And it's only, only a matter of time it will manifest in the name of Jesus. So when you fix your eyes on Jesus and you declare your confidence in Christ, the challenges of life will not swallow you. The issues of life will not swallow you. And that is when you see the hand of God manifest in your life. The hand of God will only manifest when you fix your eyes on Jesus. When you fix your eyes on Jesus, that is when the hand of God manifests in your life. But when you fix your eyes on your problems, you see, you face challenges. When you, 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 your, your challenges get bigger and bigger and bigger. Because everything your eyes keep seeing keeps getting bigger and bigger in your consciousness. But when you fix your eyes on Jesus, Jesus will take you through the storm. In Isaiah 43, he said, when you go through the fire, I will be with you. When you go through the waters, I will be with you. When you fix your eyes on Jesus, he will take you through the storms of life. He will take you through the fires of life in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Amen. Now, I want to pray with you this morning. I want us to pray together this morning concerning the issues of our life. I want us to pray this prayer with faith because I know that this prayer is going to work miracles in your life. Indeed, as we pray this prayer this morning, you shall see the hand of God in your life in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Amen. Hallelujah. I want you to lift up your hands to heaven and say, Father, I thank you for you are the pillar that holds my life. Pray that prayer right now. Father, I thank you for you are the pillar that holds my life. You, Lord, you, Lord, are the pillar that holds my life. Father, I give you praise. Jesus, I thank you. Thank you, Father, for you are the pillar. My most take her here now. Ah, you are the pillar that holds my life. You are the foundation of my life. You are the pillar that holds my life. Say that prayer to the Lord right now. Say that prayer to the Lord right now. Father, I thank you for you are the pillar that holds my life. You are the pillar 
that holds my life. You are the pillar that holds my life. You are the pillar that holds my life. You are the pillar that holds my life. Father, I thank you. Jesus, I give you praise. My team, but I bless your name. Thank you, Father, for you indeed are the pillar that holds my life in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Amen. Next prayer. Father, I thank you for I know that in the midst of my storms, you will never leave me nor forsake me. Pray that prayer right now. Father, I thank you I, for I know that in the midst of my storms, you will never leave me nor forsake me. That is his word. He said, I will never, never leave you. I will never, never forsake you. Father, I thank you for I know that in the midst of this storm that I'm going through, in the midst of this problem, in the midst of this challenge, I know you will never leave me. You will never forsake me. Pray that prayer right now. Pray that prayer wherever you are. Father, I thank you for in the midst of this crisis, in the midst of this marital problem, in the midst of these health issues, in the midst of, of these financial issues, in the midst of this problem in my family, in the midst of this challenge, in the midst of this chaos, you will never leave me nor forsake me. In the mighty name of Jesus, in the midst of this problem, in the midst of this calamity, Father, I thank you for you will never leave me nor forsake me. I know, I know, Lord, my confidence is in you. My confidence is not in myself. My confidence is not in man. My confidence is in you. 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 Is in you. Father, I thank you for I know you will never leave me. You will never forsake me. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Father. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Amen. Now pray this prayer. Say, Jehovah, my way maker. Say, Jehovah, my way maker. Make a way for me where men have said there is no way. In the mighty name of Jesus. Pray that prayer right now. Jehovah, my way maker. Consigning this situation of my life, make a way for me where men have said there is no way. In the mighty name of Jesus, pray that prayer right now, child of God. Jehovah, my way maker. Jehovah, my way maker. Consigning this situation of my life, make a way for me where men have said no way. In the mighty name of Jesus, pray that prayer, pray that prayer, pray that prayer, pray that prayer with all your heart. Pray, pray with all your heart, Jehovah, my way maker. Jehovah, my way maker. Make a way for me, Lord, where men have said no way. In the mighty name of Jesus, pray, pray, pray. Masoko Torobosha, Lebenetenekota. Jehovah, my way maker. Jehovah, my way maker. Make a way for me, Lord, where men have said no way. In the mighty name of Jesus, Jehovah, my way maker. Consigning this situation in my heart. Concerning this situation in my life, make a way. Make a way for me. You are the God that make it a way in the wilderness. You parted the Red Sea and you created a way. There is nothing that you cannot create a way. Make a way for me, Father. Where men have said there is no way, make a way for me. Make a way for me. Make a way for me, Lord. Make a way for me, Lord. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Amen. Next prayer. Oh God, cause all those who are mocking me now to bow their head in shame at my mega testimonies. In the mighty name of Jesus, oh Lord, answer them. Cause everyone that is mocking me now to bow their head in shame at my mega testimonies. In the name of Jesus, pray that prayer. Use my testimonies to answer them. Oh God, use my testimonies to answer my mockers. In the mighty name of Jesus, pray that prayer right now. Pray that prayer right now, my Father, my Father. Use my testimony. Use my testimony to answer my mockers. In the mighty name of Jesus, answer them with my testimonies. 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 Oh God, by your mighty hand, by your outstretched arm, use my testimonies to answer my mockers. In the mighty name of Jesus, pray that prayer. Pray that prayer. That's the prayer you are going to pray. That's the prayer you are going to pray. Say, oh God, 
Use my testimony to answer my mockers. In the mighty name of Jesus, use my mega testimony. Use my mega testimony to shut their mouth. Use my mega testimony to answer them. Use my mega testimony to shut their mouth. Use my mega testimony to answer them. By your mighty hand. By your mighty hand. Use my mega testimony to shut their mouth. Use my mega testimony to shut their mouth. In the mighty name of Jesus, my Father, my Lord. Use my mega testimonies to shut the mouth of my mockers. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Amen. Now stretch forth your hands towards the screen or you can lift it up to Jesus. I pray for you. The hand of God locates you now in the mighty name of Jesus. Whatever it is you are going through as you are watching this prayer right now, whatever it is that you are going through, the hand of God brings you solution now in the mighty name of Jesus. Right now, let the hand of God show up in that situation and let the hand of God bring miracles, testimonies, solutions and make a way in that situation for you in the mighty name of Jesus. You are blessed. The hand of God protects you. The hand of God fights for you. The hand of God defend you. The hand of God bring you your testimonies in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Amen. You are favored in Jesus name. Amen. Lift up your hands and begin to appreciate Jesus for answered prayers. Father, we thank you. Jesus, we adore you. Each end of days, we magnify you. Take all the glory. Take all the honor. Take all adoration. Blessed be your holy name. Blessed be your holy name. In Jesus' name, we have prayed. Amen. It is done. In Jesus' name. Amen. I encourage you to subscribe to this channel if you have not done so. And I encourage you to also be a member. If you want me to pray with you one-on-one -on -one or cancel you one-on-one, -on -one, I encourage you to join us as a member. And as you do so, the Lord will bless you much, much, much more in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Amen. Hallelujah. Keep praying. In this channel, we pray powerful prayers. Don't miss our prayers. Don't miss our live streams. And as you join us today, the Lord will bless you much more in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Amen. My name is still Pastor Ekechi Chinedu, and I'll see you in the next live stream. God bless you.